it is uh, another day the Lord Christ has made me see and uh, glorify him because many are sick others have departed this day but uh, by his grace I have seen this day that as I shall be tackling his word let I be the vessel glory is to him alone and none else the holy lord of israel he is the lord god of our salvation and then straight away i will tackle scripture in connection with the virgin mary being a virgin and dying a virgin sinless a virtuous woman and a pillar within the christianity <laughs> Um, but uh, doubters, we can say, biblical scholars who have backslided, whether they're Islamic, they're Jewish, uh, the scripture is written in a coded language. The scripture, understanding it, you need to fast and pray the Lord <laughs> to reveal these things to you. As he says in his book of St. Matthew, chapter 11, verse 27, the Son knoweth the Father, the Father knows the Son, and the Son will reveal the Father to whom, and more things whom we will. Um, hallelujah. And um, Virgin Mary, she is the virgin prophesied by prophet Isaiah in his book, chapter 7, verse 14. And uh, she is the real a pillar of Christianity because the Lord just passed through a womb. How? Really? Yes, read prophet Mika 5.2. At the end of the verse, prophet Mika writes, the one from everlasting, whose goings are from old, he will be born, or he will come out of Ephrata Bethlehem. And nobody should mislead you in any way. But uh, these uh, scholars have started studying, studying the scripture, and they say the Virgin Mary had other children. Uh, that's why I, I've told you the the book, <laughs> and the whole book, the scripture is written uh, with a coded language. I confirm to anybody listening to me who will hear this message, whether Christian or non-Christian, Virgin Mary had no other child. No, 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 no. Really? Well, uh, they've been studying the book of St. Mark, uh, chapter 6, uh, verse 3. Mark, he writes, his mother and the brothers of Jesus Christ. But when we study uh, um, St. Luke, uh, chapter 8, verse 19, he writes, brethren. When we study uh, St. Matthew, chapter 12, starting 45, 46, he writes, brethren. Brethren means his kings but not his brothers. But uh, why the gospel is written uh, like this in a somewhat contradictory way? Because the Lord said he will speak in parables. Read the book of Psalms, uh, chapter 78, verse 1 and 2. And we, 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 we go deeper in this scripture uh, um, to prove to you these uh, boys, uh, four men, and uh, the sisters, which are not too much revealed in Gospels, were born by the sister to the mother of Jesus Christ. This is Mary, the wife of Cleopas, and then she's the same Mary coming with Mary Magdalene, even to sepulchre of Jesus Christ with sweet spices to anoint his body, and as written in the book of St. Matthew, chapter 28, verse 1, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary. Uh, but how can we confirm this This is not the same Mary, mother of Jesus? And, and these scholars, they've been studying, studying, but seeing darkness, seeing nothing, as is written in a book of Ecla Ecclesiastes by um, King Solomon, is saying uh, in his book, chapter 12, verse 12, And Father, be admonished, my son, making of many books. <laughs> And without end, you see, um, and the too much study is weariness of your flesh. <clears throat> yeah, they have studied these gospels. Yeah, many scholars, even uh, uh, thousands of them are dead. 
because uh, from 2000, uh, a thousand years, finished 2000 years, um, have ended. But these people, they are blind. They have not seen this truth. Really? Yeah. I take you to book of St. John, chapter 19, verse 25, 26, and 27. We see in verse 27, in, uh, St. John takes the mother of Jesus to his own home where he used to, to stay. That's why St. John and the mother of Christ, they were not present. or They did not see where the body of the Lord Jesus Christ was laid or was buried by Nicodemus and uh, Joseph of Arimathea. Really? Read book of St. Mark, chapter 15, verse 47. We see when the Lord lord's body was being laid down it 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 it, it was witness all oh, those we all witnessed and, and this burial it was only two women mary the mother of joseph oh my god and mary magdalene and uh, that's why when we go to book of saint matthew chapter 28 verse 1 mary magdalene and the other mary so this mary is the mother of Joseph because in, in the book of uh, St. John, chapter 19, verse 25, near the cross of Jesus, uh, we see his mother and uh, his sister, who, who, is, who is called Mary. And Mary, Mary these were three Marys. And then uh, we, we now St. John confirms in verse 27, John took mother of Jesus to his home. That's why the other Mary now, she's the mother of Joseph. She's the one who was present to see the body of our Lord being laid by Joseph of our, of our mother and Nicodemus in the book of St. Mark, chapter 15, verse 47. <laughs> and, uh, that's why when you read now book of St. Luke, chapter 24, verse 10, we see the women who came to this sepulchre. One was Mary Magdalene, Joanna and uh, Mary, mother of James. So this confirms in the book of St. Mark, chapter 6, verse 3, and uh, Simon, Joseph, short for Joseph, Judah, and Simon were young men born by Mary, the mother, and the truth, the truth rather ladies or girls who are not explaining gospels, and she was sister to Virgin Mary. You see, gospel is, is, is very is very written with a hidden pen. You must study and ask Christ to reveal to you because I can see there's no scholar who has revealed this truth. I'm just revealing right now. Uh, but uh, the same people, they go on and, and, and they say uh, that they don't and uh, believe in gospels uh, uh, books that are not reliable because the writers um, uh, are third generation disciples this is a lie a lie a lie a lie a lie gospels were written by eyewitnesses apostle nicodemus even uh, the disciple who visits jesus at night the book of saint john chapter 3 his surname given by Christ is Matthew, is the writer of the book of Matthew, and, and there is a high witness. A book of Mark is written by Philip, and Philip he came from Bethsaida. Read the book of St. John chapter 1. book of St. Luke is written by Andrew, the brother of Simon Peter. And understand, Simon Peter and Andrew were disciples of John the Baptist before they followed the Lord, even in the book of John chapter 1. You see, gospel is not easy. And, and this part, that they were eyewitnesses. We see a book of John is written by Sans of Zebedee. Um, there's no biblical scholar, Jewish or atheist scholar, who knows this truth. Uh, James writes the book of John up to chapter 18. When uh, in book of Acts, when uh, we see around where uh, and, uh, and, uh, and Stephen is turned to death, as we, we see also uh, James was killed by uh, and by Herod. Uh, King Herod did kill him. That's why uh, uh, John begins to write this book of John, uh, starting also 18 up to 21. So book of John is written by sons of Zebedee, uh, eyewitnesses, and gospels are reliable.
don't believe these scholars. Uh, they have been uh, here, and, and, and hundreds of them. They, they have died without understanding, writing many books uh, just to sell and to gain, to gain profit, to gain money. But uh, they have no Holy Spirit. Who reveals this truth? And this is the truth. Uh, so, uh, so Vladimir had no other uh, children. Uh, she lived a virtuous, sinless life and uh, died a virgin. And this is the truth unto the end of the world. Oh, my Lord, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Lord, for this knowledge. One thing I, I want to warn Christians, uh, uh, those uh, within Catholic Church, they say, uh, let's pray to Mary. They have a statue, a statue of uh, Virgin Mary, they can border, they can pray, oh, tell your son uh, this and this. Uh, this uh, idolatry, we pray to Jesus Christ alone. Because in John's uh, uh, chapter 14, verse 6, he, he, he is the way, the life, and the eternal life. And we cannot pray to anybody else. In book of Psalms, chapter 2, verse 12, at the end of the verse, uh, blessed are those who trust him, even the son. So we cannot pray to the mother. Mother was just a vessel where Christ in flesh just passed. <laughs> As written in the book of St. John, chapter 1, verse 14. It's the word or, or that spirit which was made flesh. So we cannot pray to bear to anybody. Then if it, it was so, why don't we pray to Jacob? Yeah, to Jacob, uh, she was the mother of a prophetess Miriam, and a mother of Levi, Aaron, and the prophet Moses, even Law Moses. Uh, this woman had three holy people. Uh, why don't we pray to her? Oh, okay, Jacob, uh, 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 tell Miriam in heaven, uh, tell Saint Aaron, tell Saint Moses. We cannot pray to anybody. We pray to Jesus Christ alone, this is our Lord and Savior, and none, none else, none else. And, and that's why Prophet Isaiah tells you in his book, chapter 42, verse 8, Lord God, God of Hebrews, God of Israel, cannot give his glory to another, even neither his glory to grave an image. He cannot, because in the book of Exodus, we see in chapter 5, he is a jealous God. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Your Lord, bless those who have had this word. Bless those who are not saved yet to come to thy kingdom, Father, to get baptism, to repent their sins, because you are the way, and none else. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I know there are Christians under persecution, Christians who are suffering in sicknesses, and the various challenges visit them. Oh, God, be with them, guide them, and to enter the world as you shall come again. We wait for thee, because you are to our Lord and Savior, none else. Thank you for this day. Oh God, bless walk me. I repeat it to you, I remind you, Virgin Mary died a virgin, a sinless, and she's indeed a peer of the church and blessed among the women. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna to the highest. Amen.